Hello everyone, welcome in Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah with a little mini haul from a store that I've never been in before, but I heard lots about because Donna from Donna Unboxes, um, I'll link her up here and down below, she often goes to Burlington and gets some really cool stuff. So there was one in the area we were shopping, a little Anderson, South Carolina. Yes, I live in Georgia, South Carolina is just up the road. And uh, decided to go in and take a look around and I found some things. This is one of the empty bags of Burlington. Of course, it will get reused around the house. Um, gonna start with like little food type things. I had never seen this particular season, the, the Badia orange pepper pimienta naranja. It sounds really, really good. And I just think the combination of orange and pepper is probably really yummy, especially on meats. So I thought that would be fun. That was $2.99 for that. A little high for the Badia seasonings, but since I'd never seen it before, I was willing to give it a shot. Some other food things, uh, the hubby saw these and I thought they looked really good, but they're mostly for him. These are by Anastasia Coconut Patties Minis. Look at those, okay? This is $3.99 for this packet. There's shredded coconut in the middle, perfectly bite-sized pieces it says. It's not me saying it, it's on the package, and a rich chocolatey coating. Some of the flavors in here, this is the assorted pack, pina colada, original, key lime, and it says actual size shown. Of course, that won't mean anything for you there because if you're looking on a big device, that's a big coconut patty, but really, they look pretty good. We'll probably bust them out a little bit later and give them a shot. Also, something I got, oh, those were $3.99 by the way. I picked these up, I'm pretty sure these were $5.99 for a three pack of little strainers because I use these all the time in the kitchen and these have a nice handle with grippy stuff on it. Um, the packaging was already taken off because as soon as I took them out of the bag, the hubby was like, yep, these need to get washed and put up. And I was like, wait, mini haul, mini haul. So yeah, no packaging, but that's okay. Um, because that's a pretty good deal for three of them and they're pretty nice. Nice little fine mesh strainer doohickeys. Yes, doohickey is the technical term, okay? All right, some other stuff that I got for me um, were some nail polish. I know, my nails look awful right now, but I do like to polish my nails. Look at this, China Glaze. This is tips and toes, a nail lacquer with hardeners and gel and base in one. It's nail polish, y'all. Um, in two different colors here, the silver one here is I'd Melt For You. I heard that song on the way home, actually. And... This is my street, is the glittery one on this one. A little multicolored glitter action and a pretty silver. I must have a half a dozen silver nail polishes. Yeah, it's a thing. And I got another set. These are each $3.99 for the two packs, okay? Same deal, tips and toes, $3.99. The red one is on the nice list. Oh, look at that glitter. And the gold one is Celebrate. Okay. They're really pretty. I, I'm a sucker for glitter. Okay, I really am. Got a couple more things for the hubby. I found some shirts, y'all. Look, I am a frugal. Okay, I'm cheap. I'm cheap. And I don't go to regular department stores because they're so hella expensive. So I don't go and find name brand things. However, when I can find them at a deal, your girl's going for it, okay? This is a really nice shirt for the hubs little arrows, arrows pointing up and arrows pointing down on a navy blue background. It is a Kenneth Cole shirt. Okay, let's see if it gives the content there. No, I've got to look inside on the other tag for the content. It is upside down. Okay, fine, just fine. Made in India, 98% cotton, 2% spandex. So it is machine wash and dry, just on cool, of course. But did you see the price that I paid for this sucker? $7.99. The regular price, the, the suggested retail price in your local department store, $69. No, no $69. That's a bad number, okay? But $7.99, I am all over that, okay? Got another one, because I, when I saw them all together, I was like, oh yes, I'm getting them all. Um, this. That is such a cute little floral pattern that doesn't scream floral. It's just like, you know, little flowers and little dots. I like it a lot. 
This is a Steve's Jeans. If that's a name brand, y'all, you tell me because I would not know these things. Um, the original price on this was $56. The MSRP, Steve's Jeans Big and Tall, because my hubby is tall and he's a little bit big, okay? $8.99. $8.99. Find me a Walmart shirt for that price, okay? It is not happening. So that's a super nice one, too. I love this color. This is sort of a fall burgundy color. And this is a reaction Kenneth Cole, whatever that is. The original price on this sucker, $69, okay? That is the price when you're going to a department store, which I refuse to go to. And this was $14.99. Yeah. Are you kidding me? That's the back. Okay, nice print all over. Love the colors though. That is just super nice and they feel nice too. You can tell it's a nice fabric. This one is a little bit lighter weight. This is a Hager shirt and we used to go to the Hager outlet sometimes. Um, the suggested retail price on this one, $56. Okay, look at the print on that. It's kind of a plaid, but it's a black. It's sort of a gray on black plaid. Nicely done, not like, it's not a quote redneck plaid, okay? And this one was $14.99. Nice button up shirts. They all have pockets in the front because my man insists on some pockets in the front. But yeah, found all those. Was pleased with that. That's not all I got, a couple more things. Oh, one more thing for the hubby, and I might try one too. Um, espresso beans, chocolatey espresso beans, $3.99. For these by the brand Chakovia. Chakovia, man. I, I don't know what that is. Okay. And I got myself two of these things. Little spa like devices. Yaffa softening foot mask set. I have a feeling they're not going to fit my feet, but we're going to try because your girl's got some big feet. Three pair of them in here for $4.99. That is not bad. Okay for three of them, because usually if you go to the dollar store, you're getting one for a dollar. Um, these have some more fancy schmancy stuff and an al uh, aloe vera, shea butter, and peppermint. So my feet will smell like candy. Okay, and another one from Hands. This is also a value pack, three pair in here to put on your hands. And this is hemp and rosemary extract. Whatever, you know, it's going to feel good. And this also was $4.99. So going to work on my hands because you see all that. I've got some serious eczema and dry skin going on. It's happening around my eyes too, but I'm not putting those on my eyes. So we'll see. Anyway, that was Burlington. Walked around there for quite a while. There were way too many people wearing, not wearing masks because even though there was a sign on the door, all employees and all customers need to have a mask on. Cover your nose, cover your mouth. Here, you need a mask. Here's a free mask. And you still have the morons walking around without a mask on. Have y'all not heard of Omicron? Okay. Yeah. Anyway, did a little shopping. Went to Aldi too, but y'all need to see Aldi as groceries. Okay. But, um, had a little fun there. Had not been there before. So, I will probably go back there and peruse their bargains. It's one of those places you never know what they're going to have. So, yay. No shoes for me though. They had a section up to size 12, which was completely empty. Yeah, it might as well be a section to size two because I wear a 13, so. Mm. Mm. Someday, someday. Thank you for coming by. I do have uh, shoppings and hauls that I'll put up there and down in the description below as well. Come back soon. If you haven't subscribed, I invite you to do so. And leave me a comment. Have you ever shopped at Burlington? Have you ever found any good deals there? Let me know down below. See you soon. Bye, y'all.